Members of the KwaZulu-Natal legislature have been sworn in for another five years. Senzo Mpuno received praise for his re-election as the province's premier. But Inkata Freedom Party members remained largely muted in the face of the celebrations. At only nine seats, the former provincial powerhouse has been reduced by half. Among those representing the IFP is newcomer Hassan Mutala. It was very emotional and I was very passionate about politics and I was quite happy to join the legislature today. The Durban businessman says his family is rooted in the IFP. The 41-year-old served in the IFP's youth brigade before moving on to its national council and political oversight committee. But Mutala's business portfolio has garnered the most interest. The South Coast resident is a property developer and runs a chain of wholesale supermarkets. In 2011, Motala made headlines over reports that he had defected to the ANC after he appeared on TV wearing the ruling party's regalia. Four days later, Motala pledged his allegiance to the IFP, claiming he had been blackmailed into wearing the ANC's T-shirt. Motala claimed that the ANC's provincial top brass had threatened to pull the plug on his business dealings with government. Even amongst my own comrades, I don't have a problem of that sort, and I don't feel or think or I don't or I know it's not going to come back and haunt me. IFP leader Mangosuto Butelezi will meanwhile continue to lead his members in Parliament. Judith Subban, Peter Maritzburg. No more. ENCA.com